Welcome to Sikihor. Hello YouTube, Grant Peter here with you. Coming to you from Kambuhe, blah, blah, blah Falls. I'm not sure how to say it. I've been trying to say it, been butchering the shit out of it. Kambuhe Falls, I think. We got us a little bungalow, a little cottage here at Rosaria's Cove. Got this whole, whole little area here. They've got bathrooms, they've got snacks. We've got this little sitting area over here. Karina, you're not going to say hi? What? <laughs> Ooh, I just missed the swinging on the ropes. But yeah, this is just right outside of Lazi. Uh, pretty nice spot. Uh, I sure dread the dread leaving here, though, because see all them steps over there? I think there's 135 steps that goes all the way up there. So usually I'd much rather climb up. That way leaving's a lot easier. But in this case, you gotta climb down. And then when you're tired and wore out, and ready to go home, you got 135 steps to go. A little acrobat on the rope there. These rope swings, you can pay, it's either 50 pesos or 100 pesos. I can't remember. It's been. I did it last year, but I hadn't, I'm not doing it this time, or hadn't yet. She paid either $1 or $2, I can't remember. And you can swing as many times as you want. So it's unlimited. And that, that's, for a kid, that's fine, but four or five times of that, I promise you, you're, you're tired of climbing up and down them tires to get up to that, get up to the rope, so. But just a beautiful place. Uh, you can see it's got multiple layers of waterfalls. And this is all natural, folks. This is not like the, the forest camp. It's where the forest camp is kind of, uh, it's kind of man-made. It, it uses all the, the nature and stuff around it, but it's sure enough man-made. Uh, this is all natural, so you're gonna have your slippery rocks, your uh, mud and, and sharp rocks and all that you, you're gonna have to deal with. But it's just an awesome place. They've got handrails and stuff, so you can pretty much get around most of it. But if you're not in somewhat a little bit of shape, this is probably not the place for you. And I don't mean like athletic shape. I just mean, you know, you want to be able to walk a couple hundred yards or so and kind of be a little bit nimble on your feet or just not a total clutch. Because uh, some of this, all these rocks and stuff after after a little bit of traffic, it sure gets slippery. Uh, but there's lots of nice places here to just chill out like these little bungalows. You can sit and watch everybody else uh, chill out. And you can use these little bamboo ramps for the most part. That's pretty much the only. See the steps, you come all the way on this bamboo deal and you can walk right up to the, to the bungalow. So you don't have to be in too good a shape to do that. But if you want to go on these multi-terrace uh, waterfalls, the further you go, the more people that are here, the more slippery it gets. So, yeah, this is a pretty cool place. Uh, got a girl going off the rope. Oh, she just slingshotted right in there. She don't let the rope pull her up. She just slingshots. That shit wouldn't work at Jay Buckle Springs. Here in Jay Buckle, you got just a little bitty, a little bitty pool to hit, or you hit a crash into a concrete wall. This is a little different. This is more forgiving. Uh, you can kind of land anywhere and you're safe. But they've got these little rafts. All these girls do the little Instagram shot. And the guy, will rope, he'll, he'll wind up that rope and he'll swing out above them and take their picture of like a, I don't know, get the whole upper view or whatever. But they wind that rope so it don't try to spin them when they're when they're swinging, so they can keep their 
angle or their cam camera angle straight. It's just a beautiful place, folks. And like I say, this is this is about I don't know 30 minutes from San Juan. Uh, you'll come to Lazy, Lazy. How do you say that? Lazy. How you say Lazy? How you say Lazy? Lazy. She said. You come to Lazy, and it's just I don't know four or five minutes. On up the hill, I guess. But just a just an awesome place. Water's cold, uh, nice and refreshing. Zoom out so you can see the this just the river goes all the way up this little like I say multi-layer deal. We got another guy fixing the evil can evil it off the off the top rope. There he goes. He's a nose holder. He's not very professional uh, swing slinger. But see how this guy, he'll go over you and film you the whole time. But they'll wind, they'll do circles with that rope. When I was here last year, I, I did it, and I was like, what the hell are they winding that rope for? And that's because that it's got a little twist to it when they go. Here comes the cast for the ghost. Well, here's the foreign lady fixing the ghost. You can spot her a mile away. Another nose holder. She about landed on old boy's head. I don't know if she can swim because she's sure aiming for that damn inner tube. He's pulling her to safety. That's awful ballsy if she can't swim. But they've got... They've got another swing or two. You can bear it. I thought you could see it. Somebody just went on the very top waterfall. There's another. Uh, each one of these has pools about the same size. That's the size of this. And uh, the top one and this bottom one have swings. Of course, this has two swings. Usually there's somebody swinging from over here. And then this is the this is the professional version it's the it's the highest matter of fact you can go up one more layer from where all them people are you can you can go to where that guy's sitting i don't know if you can see it see that guy sitting up top there you can actually or you could last year you could go from up there too so, uh, i hadn't seen nobody do that today but yep got some more instagrammers down here doing their little Instagram photos. Here he goes again, folks. And if y'all go back, I've got a video on this place where I was a little bit, a little bit better shape back then. So y'all want to go back and check it out? I think it, uh, it has Lazy in the title. Go back. I made it back before anybody knew who I was. I think it got 50 views. <laughs> but yeah, this guy, he just pulls them apart or pulls them across this little, this little platform and they got all kinds of different people taking photos and whatnot. It's more of a, an Instagram place to chill, if you know what I mean. Got another victim on the, on the, Top deck. Woo. I don't know. For some reason he's down there to catch everybody. I don't know. That guy swinging from the, from this side. Got another victim. Another candidate. Oh, that was pretty sweet. Ain't that right? What? Ain't that right? Yes. Say yeah. Yeah. Of course. Big yes. I'd give that one a two. You get a two for that landing. Not very good. Got some more Instagrammers over here. Anyway, folks, I'm gonna get off here and enjoy this this nice cool water. Oh, these little booths, those are 250 over there, which is 
How about four dollars? Four and a quarter, something like that. And we got the Kings. We got the Kings booth right here. This is this is three dollars. I mean, uh, three hundred pesos, which is uh, about five and a half, something like that. But nice shade above you. Trees all the way around, folks. All right, folks, I'm gonna get off here. This is high tide, folks. So it's very, very beautiful. The kids jumping off the... Look at that. All right, folks, we're gonna get us something to eat. I got the crabs. I think this is spring fed, folks. Not river water, but spring fed. I think that's what the lady's telling her because she couldn't believe it. She's like, they're in the creek, they're in the creek. I said, no, it's clean water. And I think she said it comes from the ground. So, but yeah, they just come down here, do their laundry, go for a dip. And then it just spits out into the ocean, folks. It's nerdy to hear the sunrise through this old world.